About 13 years ago, I found myself amidst a group of very ambitious young people. We were all dreamers. We wanted to be the greatest in our school. We wanted to get out of school and conquer the world. We wanted to be great entrepreneurs and there's nothing you could tell us. It seemed we were unstoppable. But that's not the reality. The reality of the matter is that statistically, 98% of people don't achieve their dreams. And the same thing happened to us. More than one decade after we've departed from campus, most of the guys I knew who wanted to conquer the world a decade ago are yet to conquer themselves till date. Why is this so? Why are most people not achieving their dreams? In today's video, I'll be sharing with you the one reason why you don't achieve your dreams. If you're new here, consider subscribing so that you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Now, here is it. One of the reasons why you may never achieve your dreams is if you wait for everything to be perfect before you take actions. Life simply wasn't designed to be perfect and as long as you wait for everything you need before you set out, you'll only procrastinate year after year. The Unpredictable World These days, whenever I want to travel from one place to another, the first thing I'd like to do is check my Google Map. The Google map will show me the estimated hours or minutes it might take me to reach my destination and I'll also have the idea about where traffic congestion may be on the road. This is kind of predictable but unfortunately, life's journey is not as predictable as this. You don't just know what will happen tomorrow and the best you can do is to make use of every opportunity you have today. Most people simply complain and make excuses. I don't have enough money. I don't have enough resources. I don't have time. My kids are young. I'll start next year. The primary reason why people procrastinate is to wait till when the weather is perfect and they don't understand that the weather will never be perfect. Do you want to be an entrepreneur? You'll never have everything you need. Do you want to pursue a new career? You'll never be ready for it. Regardless of what you want to do, you won't have a perfect map and that's why you need a lot of faith. The universe needs your faith. I am a Christian and I often hear a lot of things about faith. Faith in God. What I don't hear often in the Christian setting is faith in oneself. I pray to God through Jesus this morning but I think that's just the half of the book. The other half is about me. I have to believe in myself as much as I believe in God. God said faith is the evidence of things that are not visible. This means that if I want to achieve anything, I should be courageous enough to get out and pursue it even if I don't have any resource to do it. When I started in the business world over 11 years ago, the only thing I had was faith in myself. I believed that I could do it and I went for it though I had no money and because of this I had to suffer a lot of setbacks but eventually I succeeded and I achieved my goals of building a profitable company. You won't achieve your goals if you don't believe in yourself. I don't care who you are or what spiritual orientation you have. God will not do anything for you except you're willing to believe in yourself. Steve Jobs dropped out of school when he was around age 18. He didn't know what the future held for him but he was determined to figure it out anyway. Several decades after, Jobs said and I quote, you cannot connect the dots looking forward which simply means that you cannot simply have a map of your future. You simply have to believe in the future and stand up to pursue it even when it's difficult. If you want to connect the dots looking forward, you won't achieve your goals in life. If you want a perfect map like a Google map, you can achieve your dreams. You must have faith that the dot will somehow connect itself in the future. The Big Dreamers Dilemmas I usually come across people who have big dreams. This one will tell me how he wanted to start his own business but he needed $50,000 and that one will talk about his dream of building a gigantic company which needs probably $100,000 to start. There's no problem with building a skyscraper but there is a problem when you focus on the height of the building every minute. The best way to eat an elephant is to cut it bit by bit. One of the reasons why you may never achieve your dream is if you concentrate too much on how big it is. The best way to achieve a big goal is to ask yourself every day, what can I do today? And then focus on that only. I met a guy last week who had told me he wanted to start his own business and that he had been planning about it. 
probably for many months or years and he's still planning about it. I told him, well, you don't have anything to plan. You can start tonight. And that's the truth. You don't have to plan anything. You can start pursuing any dream today. Do you want to be a great musician? You can start today. Do you want to be a successful golfer? You can start today. Do you want to be a successful entrepreneur? You don't need to plan for three years before planning because planning is an opportunity for procrastination. This is what I recommended for the guy whom I met. When you get home tonight, hold on to Google and search for 10 people who have been very successful in industry you want to build a business in. Get all their books and biographies and start consuming them. If you dedicate 30 minutes of your day every day to studying the life and works of people who have achieved great success in your field, in any field you want, that simple baby step will lead you to another simple step of actions. And if you keep taking little actions every day, at a point, the accumulation of those actions will be a great achievement. When you don't have a specific goal, I can waste 10 minutes of this video talking about how you can achieve your goal and I'll still be foolish because most people don't have any specific goal to start with. Only a few percentage of the world's people know where they are going and these are the people who achieve far more than everyone. If you want to succeed in life, you need to have frequently updated simple and specific goals. Your goal should be frequently updated because things change so fast. Like you may not bother to set a goal for the entire year because a lot of things change within one year. You may set goals for just 90 days. Don't make these goals complex. I only set about 5 goals per time. Make it simple or you won't like to read it often which means you won't let your goal inspire you day by day. If you're just starting in the path of goal setting, I recommend you start by setting only three goals for the next 90 days. Focus on those few goals. Wake up each day to do something about them. Don't be afraid of taking baby steps. And this is the summary of my discussion with you so far. If you want to achieve your goals, you have to stop expecting when the weather will be perfect. You have to believe in yourself so much that you get out without any evidence. Don't focus on the bigness of an elephant. Cut it bit by bit and one day you'll eat the whole elephant. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Do you love to start your day with high energy? Then we invite you to join our new channel which was designed to give you daily inspirational videos that will help you to become a high achiever. We call it Inspiration Tube. Look at the description box to join the Inspiration Tube. We love you.